Hey guys, my name is Chris, CEO of Lajax Media. Today I'm going to be doing a quick review for you of the Remo Recover software for Windows, also available for Mac. And there's a variety of versions as you can see here. You can visit their website, the link's there on your screen, and I also put it directly under this video. If you click on it, it'll take you to this page. And not only am I going to show you how it works, uh, but I'm going to show you how you can save close to 50% if you buy the pro version here. Uh, it's a special coupon and a special way of kind of going through a back door here and uh, getting this. I'm not sure how long it'll be available that you can buy it at this price, but uh, I'm going to show you how to do it. So once you go here, re, uh, remo recover pro and you're going to click download now for Windows. This here is going to download a free trial version on your computer. And that's the version I downloaded so I can show you how this works. And once you download it, you want to install it on your computer. And you're going to see a little icon that looks like this here. And you're going to double click it. And I've already got it running here. So here is the software. It's going to give you three options to recover files, recover drives, or recover photos, video, and audio. And you can read over here what each one of them does. And you can choose the one that best uh, suits what you need to recover. For this example, I'm going to choose on recover photos. And then it opens up a new screen here that I can choose to recover uh, deleted photos, video, and audio files quickly, or I can perform an advanced recovery of lost photo, video, and audio files. So um, unlike many of the other tools available, Remo Recover will go into detail and uh, it'll dig a lot deeper within your drives, uh, your memory cards, your whatever it is you have connected to your computer. Um, and try to e extract those files that have been deleted or lost. Uh, for the, this example, we're going to just click on Recover Deleted Photos. And then I'm going to choose my F drive here and Next. Here it says Perform an additional scan for specific file types by choosing the files based on their extensions. So what you can do here, uh, I think I can maximize it now. Here we go. What we can do here is we can choose the specific types of files we want to recover if you know what extensions they are. Now, I'm not going to go through and do all this right now, but if you know if there's a certain type of uh, picture, for example, like if they're JPEGs or uh, PSD files for Photoshop or any of these others, you can just tick those boxes and that's what it's going to show you. But I'm not going to choose those right now. I'm just going to go ahead and click Skip. And it's going to run through and it's going to start searching for music, video, and audio files. Okay, now here's a box that says all folders containing lost data are displayed under folder and additional lost files recovered after advanced file recovery scan are displayed under file with an X. So I'm not going to worry about that right now. Okay, I'm going to have these uh, blurred out, obviously, for privacy reasons. I don't want you guys to know everything that's on my computer, a lot of business stuff, and I don't want that getting out. So here we go into this account, and to recover files, all I have to do is just tick the box beside the file that I want to recover. Now, once I do that, I get down here on the bottom right and click the arrow for next, and this is one of the steps that you can do to uh, get that discount I was telling you about. Let me go ahead and show you. Uh, first is here, it's asking me if I want to save this session so it doesn't have to rescan it again the next time. I'm just going to click no, but you can choose yes. And then you're going to choose the output folder. So where do you want to save these files you're recovering them? Do you want to save them to a drive or to a CD or DVD? I'm going to go ahead and select the folder I want to put these in. And then these options here, uh, you don't have to mess with them really. Click Next. And what's going to happen because you have the free trial version? A box is going to pop up here and it's going to say, OK, you need to activate the software if you want to recover these files. So if you make it to this point in the software and click Buy Now, it's going to redirect you to this page where it says you can buy the current version that you downloaded for $49.94 or you can upgrade to the pro version for $79.94. Now, if you remember back here on the home page, you can buy it, but it's $99.95. If you go through the software and you do the scan and all that, and then you can actually upgrade for just uh, $30 more, which is $79.94. But there is also another coupon on top of that that I'm going to give you guys to use to save another 30% on top of that. So if you click on credit card or PayPal, 
we'll do credit card. You'll see where it says check to enter coupon. We're going to tick this box. And the coupon code here, let me grab it, paste it, and you can see it's R-E-M-O-P-W-A-D-S-U-30. And over here, you can see right now it's $79.94. And if I click apply, it gives us almost $24 off, bring it to $55.96, almost 50% off the regular price of $99.95. Okay, so here you can see the comparison between the three editions, the basic, the media, and the pro. And the basic edition allows you to do just really basic recovery, um, such as uh, putting things in your uh, recycle bin, on your trash can, on your desktop, deleting it. You can recover those and a few other varieties of file types. Now, the media edition goes a lot further, allows you to recover raw photo files, photos, videos, and music files. Uh, bad sectors on your disk drives and images that were created using Remo Recover. The Pro version goes further, allowing you to recover data after Windows reinstallation, uh, recover data after accidentally formatted or reformatted partitions, and the same with lost or deleted partitions, and recover data from repartition drives. So for just a few dollars more, like I said, you know, you're not going to be spending the $99, it'll only be the $55. It's really only about $5, $6 more than what you're spending here, and you're getting a lot more features. So I highly recommend that if you do decide to go with the Remo data recovery software, that you go with the pro version and get it while you can now, where it's only uh, $45 or $55. So that's a quick overview of the Remo Recover. So if you want to check it out, that link is there on your screen. It's remorecover.pro and you can get more details there and go ahead and download it, try it out for yourself, thanks.